Sometimes when you're here
Hello everyone, welcome back to another live stream. How is everyone doing tonight on this fine Sunday? We are T minus one week till Christmas. Hope everyone's excited. Literally T minus one week. Yeah, and hope everyone's excited, having a great, great weekend, and is ready to cap off the weekend uh, with some amazing uh, Civ stuff tonight. We're going to be hopping in tonight and uh, hanging out, just having some fun, causing some chaos in the city, because why not, you know? Why not cause chaos in the city? It's what we do best, isn't it, you know? Uh, anyways, let me, let me say some hellos, why don't we? <clears throat> Let's just see here. I know Dave was here earlier. City's in the house. J Storm in the house. Michaela's in the house. Wow, all three mods. Although City, I know, is too busy watching TV. MC Stag, how's it going? Bo, welcome on in. Devin Warner, how's it going? Jeff Bowles, welcome on in. Sean Sizemore in the house. How are you all? Kurt Wood, good evening. All this is going to be a nice Sunday. You know that. I saw Devin was in the house, and I think he uh, dipped. But Devin, love you, buddy. Thanks for hanging out. Kyle Blue, welcome on in. Dugway, how's it going? Troy is in the house. How is everyone doing? Yes, we got a new opening. There's a new uh, new intro. It's a work in progress. Uh, I'm going to keep adding um, uh, like photos and screenshots to it. So don't you worry. That will be not repeating right now. Like the photos repeat twice. But as we add, it'll, you know. I mean, anyways, Jameson, welcome on in. How are you? Returning the Jedi. How's it going? Welcome on in. Awesome. Welcome on in. The real Chuck. How's it going? Sweet P, James in the house, Gavin in the house, how are you all? Big T, Robbie E. Spence, how's it going? Welcome on in, Jay Davidson, the 14s. Stream elements in the house, you know, doing its thing. Hey, Bales, welcome on in, buddy, how are you? Uh, Tidy Bananas, Jacksonville Jaguars beat the Dallas Cowboys. I mean, modified football team from my local school could do that. Not saying much. <laughs> Uh, Swix, how's it going on? Chief Jimbo, let's get this party started, why don't we? Scott, how's it going? Welcome on in. How is everyone doing tonight? Kelly's in the house. Nick Barnes is in the house as well. Sean Murphy in the house. Michael, how's it going? Welcome on in. Tis the season. That is right, Doug. Tis the season. Natasha's in the house. How is everyone doing? Listen. So before we actually get in and start doing some chaos, uh, because I know everyone is right for that, we actually have to take care of a couple things to begin with, okay? We have to take care of a couple things. So, uh, the beginning of the month came around, beginning of December, and we started a Discord giveaway that was only on Discord, and it was... A giveaway basically if you boosted the discord server using discord nitro you got your name entered for a chance to win a free t-shirt from my merch collection and the deadline was today and I said we were gonna pick live on stream a winner we we're gonna spin a wheel we were gonna pick live on stream and we're gonna get someone a piece of merch as the first giveaway. I said that, and today, guess what? It's that day. Today's the day we pick that person. So I just wanna I wanna be fair here, okay? So let's go here real quick. So this is the tracker that I've been keeping track of, everyone, okay? And we're going to go through this together. You can see these are all marked no, even though I have them all in here. But we're going to go through this together, okay? So these are all the people that I've kept track of. You you could enter your name up to five times if you boosted it five times. Some people did it two. Some people did it one. Some did three. Okay? Um, 
But anyways, these are the names that I pulled from the server logs that had boosted the server and how many times they had boosted it. So we're going to go through here. I'm going to side by side this and we're going to make sure it should be in order. We're going to make sure that one by one, these are in here. Okay. And if anyone thinks they boosted the server and they didn't see their name on here, we will, uh, we'll figure it out live on stream here. Okay. And these are your discord names, not your YouTube names. Okay. So just keep that in mind. So here we go in order everything's gonna match so we're gonna change these to yes as we go down raven's got two see i see raven's name on there twice so we're gonna change these to yes barrel's got two in there well oh city i missed city city's got their name in there once barrel's got it twice Agent's got it twice. All right. Your muddy buddy's got it three times. One, two, three. We'll change these all to yes. Ranch and Terry's got one. Mr. Scar's got one. Troy coming in the last minute just got one. And then Michaela has one. Does anyone see any discrepancies? <laughs> I think I nailed them all. There's 15 in here. There should be 15 in here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Okay. We should be good. Does anyone not see their name on here that thinks they boosted the Discord server? Speak now or forever hold your peace. Because we are going to spin this wheel. And we are going to find who the winner is of the first merch giveaway. Anyone? Going once. Going twice. Going thrice. All right, here we go. Here is our lovely wheel. Hold on, let's, let's lower this down. Let's turn this up. Here we go. We're going to spin the wheel in five, four, three... Two, one. It's out of my hands. So help me if this is Michaela. God. <laughs> why did why did I have to say that? Oh my god. Well, it is not rigged. I promise. <laughs> I promise. Uh, it is not rigged. Although some days I feel like it is. <laughs> okay, now I gotta take a screenshot of this and post it in the Discord. Okay. Hold on, now I gotta compose a Discord announcement real quick. I promise this is not rigged. At everyone. I pr promise this is not rigged. But congratulations to our first Discord merch. Giveaway winner at Akela. <laughs> I promise it's not rigged. People are gonna get called out for being rigged. All right. Well, hold on. I gotta add some emotes to this. Uh, hold on. Making it fancy, okay? 
Well, let's just let's just go here for a minute while I fancy this up. Boom. Post the picture. Send it to 200 and something amount of people. Because I don't care. <laughs> I promise, chat. It's not rigged. It's not rigged. I'm like, please, please don't let this be Michaela. Yeah, pops up Michaela. Uh, anyways, tonight, we are going to get in. We're going to do some Civ nanigans. Okay, some Civ shenanigans. And, uh... Yeah, and just have fun. There are currently a crap ton of Sibs on and two cops. Well, one cop and one just got on. So, we'll see. <laughs> we'll see what happens. Um, also, I gotta say... Someone donated before the uh, stream even started... So thank you, Devin, for the $10. I appreciate that. And also thank you to Timothy Lovell for the $4.99. What an unfortunate turn of events. Oh, wait. I mean, congrats. Timothy, thank you for the $4.99. I appreciate it. And welcome on in. Thank you for that. Uh, Potter99, how's it going? Welcome on in. Welcome on in. Connor, how's it going, too? I don't think I said hi to you earlier either. Welcome on in, everyone. Bryce Collins, how's it going? Welcome on in. Little Turtle. Jock and Condor are doing a different stream. Yeah, I saw that. Orthotonic RP? No. No, no, please no. Anyways, I figured tonight we start off with the one and only Susan Whitehead, our HOA lady. And we just cause... Because there's not a lot of cops on currently, I figured we will, um, we'll just get in and we'll cause some mayhem a little and just, like, be annoyed at people and do all that fun stuff for a little while, you know? That's what I figured we'll start with. And then, uh, I do want to potentially rob a bank tonight. I'm just saying. Like, I think Steven Tyler needs some money. Um. So... I think Steven Tyler needs some money and another warrant. Just saying. Kelly, I'm doing good. How are you? Gavin Durbin, how's it going? Welcome on in. Demon Gamer with a $20. Man, you gotta stop. Thank you very much for the 20. I appreciate you, but man, you, you can relax. It's okay. Uh, how the editing from last night's stream? Uh... Well, I, I opened up Premiere Pro last night after while we were kind of chatting about it with Diaz and all that after the stream and just to make sure all the footage was good. So I haven't touched it yet, uh, but we'll get to it. Don't don't worry. It'll, it'll probably be. It'll probably um, be the end of the year by the time you see that footage. I'm just saying it's like five and a half hours and a bunch of Rockstar editor clips and everything, which take hours to do so. You know, it'll be, uh, it'll be some time. Go tire hunting in the city with a rifle? I mean, maybe we can just go slash people's tires. It's always a possibility. I'm good hanging out while Paul is flying. Where's he flying to today? One of these days, I'm just going to book a flight that he's flying and just annoy the crap out of him. Because he annoys the crap out of me. I'm going to do it. I'm going to live stream it too. Just wait. Some criminal activity? Yeah, we're, well, it's going to start kind of just... Not necessarily criminal, but like... Pissed off civilian. And then um, we'll get into some criminal stuff. Once we get some, some more... You realize the weather conditions out here. I am literally backing up right now. Wow, this 
kill is disastrous in the summer or in the starting off good people starting off good <laughs> sakes oh i can't catch a break tonight can i anyways like i was saying i don't even know we're gonna start off civilian and then uh we're gonna go um and do some criminal stuff i do want to rob a bank like i said but still can't believe diaz with the betrayal oh i can I can. I can 100% believe Diaz is a betrayal. It's Grapeseed PD, man. They're paid off. Paid off. Flew from California to Boston and now trying to get home. But of course, flights are crazy. It's that time of year. It's that time of year. And we got a bunch of weather moving in, too, in Northeast. So that probably doesn't help. Yeah, I said summer. I meant winter. It's whatever. I want it to be summer already okay summer days will be here soon in like six months for me <laughs> uh here uh where where oh where oh where there it is Look, nothing, nothing happened. Although, I did just notice, and I forgot about this. Everyone see Santa in a sleigh? This is part of the uh, NVE Christmas update. Hell, how, how? I wonder if I can actually get in this. Oh, I can. Oh, look at that. At least you didn't get pro. Oh! Watch where you're going. Come on, ma'am. You know who I am? Hey, HOA lady, president, lady deal. Not HOA approved? No, I think we'll HOA approve that, but the Merry Christmas sign up there on the tree. I think I think that's not HOA approved. Yeah, hold on. Let me let me set this as my personal vehicle because <laughs> I feel like I'm gonna piss the people off and they're gonna want to steal it. Yeah, I don't think these signs. Oh God, it's a little weird. Uh, you know what? I'm not going to HOA this because not everyone runs NVE and these are NVE things. So they won't, they won't see them. So we will just, uh, we're not gonna, I was best that I thought about that now and not later because, uh, that would not be great. What's the letter like? It's I'm in Scotland and it's freezing. James, it is currently... Hold on, let me look at my phone real quick and get the uh, temperature. Uh, currently, right now, for me, it's 28. Real feel of 21. And it's getting ready to snow. So... I think we need to go to a like 24 7 or something. Oh, you know what? Is that Ponzi Boys open? Oh, look at there's Santa and that sleigh too. I think we need to go here and complain that the floor is dirty and call the police. Purple Miss, how's it going? Welcome on in. A sleigh trailer being pulled by a lawnmower reindeer. I don't know if we have a small enough trailer for that. <laughs> I 
It's a mariachi car, but it's really just me. Oh my god, look how dirty these floors are. Ah, disgusting. Clean your floors, man. Ah, I gotta call someone about this. All right, let's see if, uh, see if anyone earth Church of the Holy Hangover Revival at the Mega Mall parking lot. Let me save your soul. Ah, Jason. Jason, Jason, Jason. Ah, boy. Need to go to the Mega Mall and start a dispute? Yeah, I think I do. God damn. 911, where is your emergency? Oh my god, yes. It's not. It's uh, 696, and we're on... Uh, hold on, let me get the street. What street is that? Oh, it's Portola Drive. We're at the Ponzi Boys here. Okay, and what's going on there? My name is Susan Whitehead. I'm the president of the HOA in Vinewood, and oh my god, there is this... I'm, I'm in here, I came to get jewelry, and then it smells like like rotten eggs in here, and it looks... The floor's all dirty, no one really cares. I need someone to come down here and tell them to clean their damn floor. Okay, is there an emergency going on there, or... You, yeah, their floor is dirty, and I'm walking on it. Well, ma'am, that's not really a, uh, an I emergency I need someone for... to get down here right now! I can't have a dirty floor touching my feet. Okay, uh, I'll see if I got an available unit to head that way, okay? Yeah, make them quick. Oh my I god, will. the paint's on the wall is chipping too. Ah, oh, disgrace. Alrighty, Miss Whitehead, just uh, go ahead and sit tight for me and we'll get a unit over there, okay? Yeah, I will, thank you. All righty, you have a good day, Miss Susan, and uh, if you have any other problems, go ahead and give us a call back, uh, especially if it's an actual emergency. <laughs> so rude. <laughs> oh, Henry, I feel sorry for you. Microsoft Excel gonna kill me. Hold on, hold on. I'm gonna, nope, that's the wrong one. Nope, that's also the wrong one. Civ adverts. Um. How do you spell Ponzi boys? Floors are dirty and the paint walls is chipping. This message. No. Susan Whitehead. H. Oh, I can't. I want to put HOA at the end. <laughs> oh my God, thank you so much for coming quickly. Uh, hi, is your name uh, Susan White? Yeah, it's Susan Whitehead. I'm the president okay. of the HOA in Vinewood right up there. Okay, and what's going on? I got a call uh, just saying that there's okay. a dispute going on here. You walk in there and you tell me if you think that place is appropriate to go shopping, okay? Because if you ask me, if the floors are dirty, the paint on the wall is chipping, it smells like something died in there, and just no one cares. They're all just sitting there like, how can we help you, miss? No, clean your damn floors. 
Paint your damn wall. Put an air freshener up. This is unacceptable, and I demand this be changed. And you called the police for that? Yes. <sighs> okay. Um, Hold on. What's your name and badge number? My name is uh, Henry with the LSPD badge number 387. Okay. Yeah. Again, I, I, let me just reiterate for the, the, the camera here. I called you because their floors are dirty, the paint on the wall is chipping, they're, they're, it smells like something died in there, and they're all just standing around like doing nothing, okay? You need to go in there and fix it. Alright. Uh, I'll go see what's going on. Just hang out here for me, okay? Yeah, I will. I'm gonna follow him in. And record from the door. Yeah, you tell him what you told me. Yeah, go ahead. Freaking manager. I'm, I mean, uh, the the, uh, the floors look pretty clean to me. Do, do you so. see this? It's dirty, man. But I mean, look you... at the walls over there. It's like the paint's chipping. Is that signs of like water damage? You should condemn this building. Well, I, you know, I don't have the authority to do that. That's it's the building. Well, then call someone that and... does. Ma'am, I don't think uh, a little bit of paint chipping off the wall. Is... I want your sergeant. I am the sergeant. I want your lieutenant then. Uh, I, we don't have uh, anyone. Uh, okay, on duty I right need now. a supervisor then. Anyone. Uh, we don't have any on duty right now. So. Uh... Whatever. <laughs> oh. Oh, poor Henry. All right, let's go to the Mega Mall. Wait. One, one star on Twitter. <laughs> oh. Manager wants them trust past or life. Surprise the manager didn't have you trust pass. Well, they're trying to now. Oh, smells like Chuck Livingston. Yeah, that would probably would have been a better uh, descriptor. Everyone knows that smell. You in Washington? No, I'm in New York. Someone's sitting around their horn. I totally run it, but he's sitting right there. All right, off to the Mega Mall we go. I don't know how I'm going to play it yet, but we're going to go at least cause some disturbance down there. This Escalade can haul, though. Oh, my God. I'm preparing for an arctic blast on Thursday. I'm preparing for a foot of snow between tonight and tomorrow at 5 p.m. So. Then again, what's new? Better than six to seven feet, I guess. <laughs> Literally had a Karen at work last night. Took me an hour to get rid of her. Freaking Karens.
expired coupons yeah we should go to like the 24 7 and try to get like a buy one get one free strawberry rails with expired coupons Oh, I forgot this. I forgot I had that horn. Oh, that just brought me flashbacks to f flying towards Paul with his campaign whatever in the uh, the U tool where I went airborne and damn near killed everyone. Hope he's still here. I don't see anyone besides whoever's in that car, and I don't trust them. What? What do you mean I've been trespassed for life? What is... Oh my god, there's a fire! There's a... F there's a fire over there. Yeah, that man threw a Molotov. Where is he? Go beat him with a shoe. Uh, he sped off that way. All right, I'm calling 911. 911, what's the location of your emergency? Oh my god, it's 121 at the Mega Mall. There's a fire, and some dude literally just threw a Molotov, and it almost killed me. All right, we will get units down there. Yeah, you better tell them to hurry the hell up because the guy took off, and oh my god, the entire parking lot's on fire now. We're all gonna okay, die. Okay, what kind of vehicle was he in? It was like a red car. I don't know. It was it's his door sitting in the parking lot here. Alrighty, we will get up. We will get units out there. Yeah, it looks like there's one pulling in. Thank you for nothing. Yeah, yeah, no problem. You're welcome for nothing. So rude. Also, why is he taking 911 calls? He's in freaking the Civ chat. I saw it. I saw it all. Okay, hold on just one second for me, okay? Oh my god, you need devil, to get this city under control. First dirty floors, now there's a parking lot on fire. Hold on for me, Susan. <sighs> These cops. It's not the cops, young ma'am. It is the devil. The devil is working hard in Los Santos today, I'm telling you. Well, I, someone dirtied the floor at my favorite Ponzi boy up in this, in, in Vinewood, and I'm so pissed. Oh, you've got the dirty footsteps of the muddy Mustafeles himself. Beelzebub is up in your clothing boudoir, ma'am. What do you want, Grandpa? Uh, hello. How's it going, Jimmy? Bye. Brother Jimmy is back. Hallelujah. How you feeling there, Brother Jimmy? Uh, I feel wonderful. Excellent, and how are the tears of the Lord working inside uh, you right tasty. now? Absolutely. Are you ready for another bottle? Sure. All right, that's going to be $20 well, this time around. First taste was free. Uh, now I need to get my roof the fixed at the church. Okay, uh, sir, here in the suit, could I talk to you for a second? Absolutely, uh, brother. It's called officer. out. I'm leaving. I'm going to go to the LTD there and complain that their floors are dirty.
I'm gonna complain there's blood on the floor and like, I don't know. Disgusting. There you go, boss. Thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, you need to clean your floors. It's disgusting in here. Up. And you need to shut up. I'm sorry. I do what I want with do my you know floor. who I am? I do not care who you are. Oh, do you? Okay. Well, hold on. Let me call the cops. You do that, ma'am. I didn't know the equipment was uh, delivered yet. Is she really calling the cops because I told her to shut up and I didn't care what she said? <laughs> uh. You can't trespass me. A cop's got to do it. Nine one one. What is your emergency? Oh my God! Yes, thank you so much for answering quickly. Um, I'm at the LTD on Grove one two zero. Uh, and. I don't know if he's a store clerk or what, but I walked in and I told him that he needs to clean his floors because they're so dirty and like I can feel the bacteria like souping into my feet when I walk in there. And then he told me to shut the hell up and leave. And he's being very rude and he, he's not doing what I asked him to. I'm the president of the HOA. I demand this be fixed. Okay, what is your name? It's Susan Whitehead. Okay, what's a good callback number for you, Susan? Uh, 807. And you better hurry up before I have to take matters into my own hand and clean his floors for him. Because then I'm going to start billing him and charging him. Ma'am, I'm going to okay, have so to Okay, so you're just upset that he premises. hasn't cleaned the floors? Yeah, he his floors are dirty, and then he told me to shut the hell up when I when oh I told him God. about it. I do not care the floors and, are dirty! And now he's yelling at me in front of my face. Get off my property! Okay, um, well, I'll make sure that some officers get that's at the 24-7 Echo Street, so it shouldn't ass. be too long, okay? Okay, yeah, tell them to make their best time. You guys were I not will. exactly quick the last time I called. We will get there as soon as they possible, all right? Care, you okay, can. hurry up. You know what? Thank you. you. My name is Susan. Get it right, bitch. Okay, Susie, I don't fucking care! Sounds like Garen to me. God damn. Why is he bleeping These himself? These bitches are crazy! Why is he bleeping himself? <laughs> like, bro, chill. You can't bleep yourself in game. It's like, not even remotely close to RP, but okay. Yeah, I can feel the bacteria souping into my feet. Oh, you can hang on the sides of these. I didn't know that. Well, that's good to know. All right, let's get gas while we're here too. Beautiful. Yeah, no one's gonna block me. Oh, never mind. Hello. Officer, how are you doing today? I don't know why she called. Oh my god, bitch, thank move, you. Fucking move, bitch. Hey, I called I him. I don't know. Cool, good for you. Well, I'm speaking to him first. So you can get the fuck no, back in you your car and get, get off out. my property. Wait, Susan, Susan, go over by your. But I uh, called you, so why does he get to talk to you first? 
Bitch, if well, you do not I'm... get over, get away from my personal space, I will hurt you. Right, I'm sir. sorry, what? Did you hear that, officer? That's a threat. Get the fuck away from me. I do right. not like you, blonde bitch. All right, sir. Go ahead and go inside the store, please. Well, I'll, yes. I'll speak to you in a second. Dimitri. Oh, there's another one. I'll go talk right, to them in a second. All right. What's going on, Susan? Okay, I walked in. I had all of attention. I was going to do my daily grocery shopping, get my butter, get my coffee mix, all that fun stuff, right? And so I walked to the frozen aisle and, like, the, the coolers and all that. And I looked out, and I can literally feel the bacteria oozing into my feet because his floors are dirty. And I'm like, okay, whatever. I'll tell him. I'll be nice like I did earlier. And I'll be like, I'll tell you, you know, clean your floors, whatever. So I walked up to him like, hey, clean your floors. They're dirty. And then he just starts yelling at me and calling me a you-know-what and calling me a Karen. My name's Susan. It's not Karen. It's Susan. Okay? And then I come out, and I'm like, okay, fine. I'm going to call you guys. So I called you. And then... He comes out and he starts getting in my face, calling me, you know, all these names and everything. Okay. And then well, I just went to get gas, and then you you heard him here. He said he was going to hurt me. I want I want to press charges on him for threatening me. Do you okay. know who I am? Uh, I'm a public official, damn it. I'm the president of the HOA. Well, first of all, Susan, you can't keep calling 911 for dirty floors. It's not an emergency. Well, he You're also threatened out. me, though. I know, but that's not why you called. Well, I called so because you... he got in my face, too, and called me a dumb bitch. Okay. Well. Are you going to arrest him? Anything... I can't do anything about the dirty floors, okay? That's not my job. That's the, <laughs> the LTD's job. If you don't like it, you don't have to come here. You can go. You can do your shopping somewhere else. Oh, I'm going to. I'm gonna. Um... I, I'm totally going to. 24-7 seems way better. Okay. Uh, that would be my concurrence. Um, don't, don't, uh, don't tell anyone else I said that, but, uh, you, I'll talk to the guy inside. I'll look at the cameras and everything. See, uh, see if your guys' stories line up. Um, well, regardless, he, you heard him. He threatened to hurt me right here in front of you. I want to press charges for that regardless. Okay. All right. I'll talk to this other officer here and see what the guy inside said. And we'll go from there. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Make it quick. It's cold out. I will. Joe Bama, how's it going? Welcome on in. Right, um, so Why can't I get through here? Kind of walked in, caused a disturbance, and uh, they asked her to leave, and then we showed up. They didn't ask me to leave. I walked out, and then they were yelling at me. <laughs> Susan almost got shanked. I'm going to shoot this dude. I got a pistol. Yeah, I want police protection for the rest of the night. I know. Why are you being a caring? This is the HOA ladies that the entire group of guys have. It's like if you don't hurt away or if you don't get away, I'll hurt you or something like that. Try to get trespassed around. I'm going to go to the 24-7X. I hinted at it. 24-7. I'm going to try to go to the 24-7 and get my uh, two-for-one uh, BOGO uh, strawberry rails on an expired coupon. I got a taser and an SNA. It's Susan Whitehead. Yes, president of the HOA. Uh, okay, uh, Susan, What I, I heard that there were some threats made, not by you, but by the store owner. Do you know what was said? Yeah, so the your partner pulls up, right? And I called him, so I went over to talk with him. And then the other dude, the store clerk or whatever, he comes out. He's, like, talking to him first. And I'm like, hey, hey, I, I called you. I have to talk to you first. And then he's like, if you don't back away, you blonde you-know-what, then I'm going to hurt you. Okay. Like a blonde B-word? Yeah. Okay. Um, he just said, I'm going to hurt you. He didn't say, like, how he was going to hurt you? No, no. He just said, I'm going to hurt you, and then, like, turn to me, and that was it. But it's still okay. threats. He still threatened yeah. violence, and I want charges pressed. Okay. I'm a public official. I work for the HOA. I'm the president of the yep. HOA. I'm elected. I want yep. him charged. 
Yep. I okay. We can we can go down that route. Um, but I do have some bad news for you as well. Um, you are going to be trespassed. You're not going to jail or anything, but it's just a trespass warning for all LTDs and 24 sevens, according to that guy. Um, and it's a lifetime trespass. Okay. L 24 sevens too. It's an LTD, man. Apparently they're merged. I, you'd yeah. have to talk to corporate about that. Okay, but. so this guy just told me to leave all the LTDs and go to 24-7, so. Uh, okay, and I, I, think I, I mean, I a, don't really know. I think as a store clerk, he can only trespass me from here. Okay, uh, well, you're going to have to go through the civil stuff about that. I'm not 100% sure what the legal grounds of the LTD and 24-7 are, so that's going to be a civil matter. But as of right now, um, let's just have you not come back to this LTD. Um, you, you, I, I know that you'll be trespassed from this one, okay? That's fine. I don't care. They're floor Again, like I told this other officer, I could when I walked in, I could feel the bacteria oozing into my feet. Gotcha. So it's kind of a win-win. Yeah, I would say so, as long okay. as he's going to jail for the threats. Okay. Give me one moment. All right, I'm going to go talk to <laughs> them one more time. Oh, boy. Amazing. Amazing. He made a bad mistake by threatening me in front of a cop. Of course I'm going to pursue that. I'm a Karen. He knows that. <laughs> oh, I, we totally have to go to the twenty four seven now, right? Hundred percent. Oh, that guy is wasted. Oh my god. Hey, what's up, sir? Hallelujah. Sir, you in the uh, brown jacket there? You, uh, why don't you come talk to me here for a second, okay? Why? Teaming up with anyone else tonight? Um, not like, uh, okay. officially, but I mean, if we run into someone and start doing something, we might. Kind of, kind of but weird. not like, okay? we're not gonna have, like, old man with us or yeah, any of those yeah. other guys. What's your name, man? Joshua. We're just gonna hang out and chill. James. He was like, Joshua he was like right here, like, getting in my face and, and, and pushing me and everything. You, uh... Had anything to drink? Pushing you? What are you talking about? Yes. Never insult an HOA lady? Exactly. I never was there. I literally walked up in front of the cast register and was talking to him across from the register. Two trust <laughs> five minutes. Soon to be three as soon as we get out of here because we're gonna go to the twenty four seven and instantly get um uh instantly get trespassed from there for using fake coupons or expired coupons. Should they be fake or should they be expired? I think they just need to be expired by like a year. <laughs> and he's, any uh, signs of weird sounds or alien light forms? Not tonight. Not not quite tonight. Yeah, I wasn't like I could see where he was standing. He was at like the end of the counter by the coffee machine. I'm like, no, I wasn't even there. I walked up closest to the glass right in front of me. I would just TV still. Okay, I would just look up uh, in your CAD. Three four six charge for that. Because I don't know off the top of my head. Good. Well, they're gonna be expired by like well over a year. At the at the least. Mainly because. I'm just gonna be adamant that it says like, you know, they expired the 24th of December, and like it's not the 24th of December yet, but it's gonna be like the 24th of December, like 2018 or something. Twenty-four-seven. 
12 trespasses are Christmas. <laughs> there it is. About Leahy. Yeah, Leahy is the owner of LTDs and 24-7s, and they did merge. But, um... I'm pretty sure the store clerk can't get you trespass from all of them. It's got to be like a regional manager or like a manager or something like that. Hold on. E smoke. Get my SIGs out. Right next to the gas pumps. Any sign of Jimmy Carroll? Yeah, he's in the car right over there. Oh, yeah, Jimmy's in that car right there as a the passenger next to me. Is anyone going to notice I'm smoking? Try using two 50% off coupons for a 100% discount. Just so you know, it's we could that too. I'm just going to have them go their other way so we can wrap this up. It's busy here. Is there not a criminal threat? <laughs> right. There's a hundred percent of criminal threats. Oh, I'm googling it. I'm pulling up the penal codes right now from Florida. There's a hundred. There's gotta be. Threats. Susan. What do you want? One. Okay, two things. One, you're smoking next to a gas pump. And? Can, can you put that out, please? I don't feel like <sighs> exploding. Whatever. Okay, second thing. Um, so, I looked up the law. There's nothing that says a verbal threat of violence. Um, that's I, I really can't get him for anything. It's really written, and it's about, like serious bodily harm so like shooting or murdering or whatever so and um so i'm not able to do that but i think we're gonna go our separate ways and you're gonna be trespassed no one's going to jail no one's going to court nothing like that okay oh whatever all right have a good day susan screw yeah, you lock your door lspd you sucks yeah 332, the, uh, LG. <laughs> uh, there's gotta be a criminal threats in there somewhere. Can't just threaten to hurt. So if you're saying if I go to Florida and threaten to hurt someone, but don't tell them how that I'm fine. Well, no, he threatened to hurt me. Like, he, he threatened to hurt me physically. Maybe it's just because New York's a soft state and you threaten to give someone a paper cut, they arrest you. I mean, they don't keep you in jail because, uh, you know. But... You threaten someone with, like, you don't even have to tell them why you can get arrested. Yeah, the, the Popo's Tahoe being slammed, I saw that too. Yeah, he literally squared up to me. And then he lied right to the police that I was right in his face. I was across the counter. It's all right. Susan's packing, man.
shoot him? I'm, I thought about it for a minute. Not gonna lie. Like, I'll be straight up. I thought about it. But I don't know what that bodyguard's doing. The bodyguard would probably pull out, like, a minigun or something. Knowing my luck. Charges threat to commit a crime? Well, he threatened to hurt me, which is assault. So I guess that's technically a threat, right? Technically speaking, at least. Get a guard dog or a cougar. There it is. In Florida, verbal assault such as defamation, libel, or extortion is considered a second-degree felony. It has a legal definition of extortion that includes threat of injury to another person. Yeah, but it doesn't say by means, so they they realistically could have got me or could have got him easily. Already here, LTD's paying the cops off. I feel like Susan needs to do a drive-by on that place at some point. I got the green light. I got my coupons. I'm ready. I wonder if there... Nope, there goes the blimp. I wonder if there's like a cereal box emote. Hold on. Prop. Area food bang. Hmm, coffee. No. Although, let's see here. Oh, that's like actually carrying it. No, oh, okay. Oh. We're gonna do two fifty percent that are both expired by three years. What do we want? We need well, we definitely need our strawberry veils. Look at that. Let's grab two boxes of those. Yeah. Okay. Uh what else? What else? What else? Uh that's all beer. Uh I don't want fishy sticks today, no. No. I do need my apple juice though, that's right. Now let's grab our apple juice. And, uh, oh, let's grab a ham, too. Yeah, we can make, uh, we can make ham for dinner. Yeah, yeah, let's, let's, let's do this. And I got two, two fifty percent off coupons, uh. But, yeah, that should be a hundred percent off for all this, right? Oh, no? It's two fifty percent, like, fifty percent off. Fifty and fifty don't equal a hundred, right? They're expired. No, you better scan those damn things. I'm taking my shit and leaving. You won't take them? Oh, come. Don't make me call. I got the phone out. Don't make me call them. Two males waving guns at each other. Shots fired. Oh, boy. We're not going to get a cop. We're not going to get a cop. I'm calling right now. But with that going on, I doubt we'll get a cop. At least for the time being. Mm-hmm. 
<clears throat> yeah, Chris, we don't we don't talk about that idiot. The hell was that? That wasn't an explosion. That was like something. Chad Oaks, how's it going? Welcome on in. You should buy him a burger, but the patty is made of dog poop. You should take it to the security guard. There it is. Those are not. Those are close. At this rate, Susan is a worse 911 caller than Anita. That's getting close. Lock your keys in your car and ask for police assistance. True story. There's only of the one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven law enforcement agencies in my county. Only one of them will do lockouts. Unless there's a child or a dog in the vehicle. Or, a, a, I mean, not a person, like, a, someone who can't care for themselves in the vehicle, pretty much. But if it's just, like, you lock your keys in your car, not my problem. Call a tow company. They don't want the liability. That car blown up there. Oh no, the person just left. Gotcha. I'm just going to do it in here. One, two, five. I think this is strawberry, right? Innocence. to do this 911 uh actually not I'll do this 911 125 innocence There we go. Oh boy, oh boy. How long have you been in this server? Uh, over a year. Year and th three and a half months, going on four months now. I joined uh, the end of September, early October of last year. Now we wait. Now we wait. You like it? Yeah, I love it here. OCRP is a great, it's not even a community, it's literally a family. 
Like last night after you end a stream, there was like ten of us just hanging out, chatting, having a good time, talking about like real life stuff, personal stuff, all that fun stuff. You know, just hanging out, being friends. Just commented on last night. Shane Bug has been in some dark RP lately. First Chuck is a human head in his trunk, and he's involved in a four-star killer's bar rampage. <laughs> yeah, and then the aliens. Yeah, no, he's... Plus the video that's coming out tomorrow, unless you're a member, a uh, senior officer right now, um, the video that's coming out tomorrow is the uh, shootout we had with him and the standoff we had with him at the Humane Labs. Just came back. What are we waiting for? A cop. That's what we're waiting for. But they had reports of uh, two men shooting at each other, so... You know, that might change how long we wait. Considering there's only three cops on, so. When can other people join OCRP? No idea. <laughs> Couldn't tell you. I, I don't know. Chuck is actually just a failed experiment at Humane Labs. Listen, you said it, not me. Yeah, it's the one from a few weeks ago, Easy. Yeah, where Fish Police murdered 197, murdered Carl. 911, where's your emergency? Oh my god, yes. It's 125 on Innocence Boulevard at the LTD. 125 Innocence, okay, what's going on there? Yeah, I don't know if you know me. My name's Susan. I'm the president of the HOA in 91, and I came down here because the LTD kicked me out because they were being jerks and they think that it's okay to just kick us out. Regardless, anyways, I came up here because I still need to get my items and now they won't accept my 50% off coupons. Okay. So, uh, they kicked you out of the store? No, they haven't kicked me out. I'm, I'm literally standing here with the clerk in front of me and he just won't accept my coupons. And I need someone okay. to come down here and tell him that my coupons are good and that he legally has to accept them. Okay. Yeah, you, you said your last name was Whitehead, right? Yeah, Susan Whitehead, President HOA. Okay, Miss Whitehead, uh, we'll get an officer out there as soon as possible. Uh, they're very busy at the moment, so it might be a couple minutes, but... Uh, Rest assured, we will get one out there to speak with you, okay? Well, if they're not here in the next five minutes, I'm suing you. So, good luck. You know, you better get them here. Just hangs up on them. I literally left the channel. <laughs> Just click. Hangs up. Uh, tell the cop off when he gets here. I'm going to tell him it took him too long. They could roll up right now and I'm going to tell him it took him too long. Very busy. There's only three of them. And there's currently one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve civs in to three cops. So, <sighs> 
We're going to go Elio and help. I don't know. I, w I want to rob a bank, but there's definitely not enough cops for that. So uh, we're going to go through the Susan stuff that I kind of got planned. I, I got one more little thing I want to do and see. And then we'll, we're going to reevaluate the numbers and probably do a poll on it. Oh boy. Because ultimately I want to do a Civ stuff. I haven't done Civ stuff in a while. Um, but, uh, you know, if they're getting overrun by 12 to now 2 because it looks like one of them crashed, um, then, uh, you know, we're going to probably have to make a switch here. Because they've already put cries for help out. Oh, looks like uh, Jason switched to be an LEO too. <clears throat> well, now it's 3 to 11. <laughs> we'll see. I want to wait for this cop though, because this is going to be good. Wonder what the IRL ratio to cops to civs is. Well, I can tell you, in the county I uh, work for, our population is about 120,000 spread over about 1,200 square miles. A uh, very rural county. And the night shift, so 6 p.m. to 6 a.m. for county law enforcement, in in excluding the two cities that hold 60% of the population in the county. Um. They're very small cities too. They got like 30, 40,000 people a, a city. But excluding those two cities, the county between the sheriffs and state police is. What? Oh my God, it's a lot of explosions. Um, is six cops. There's three sheriffs on and usually three troopers. Um, the cities, one city will have four because they break their city into zones, the other city will have two. So collectively speaking, in the entire county, again, it's 1,200 miles, about 120,000 is residents. Um, there's about 12 cops. So things can get hairy quite quite quickly. Hayden, I was just thinking about Lego Stream. I, uh, I'm thinking it's probably going to be uh, one of two times is my initial gut reaction. It's gonna be during, oh, oh, there's a cop, there's a cop. It's gonna be uh, either Wednesday or th Wednesday this week, because I got plans for Thursday, which I'm gonna announce towards the end. It's gonna either be Wednesday this week, Tuesday next week, or Sunday next week. That's my initial, unless major things happen. Uh, actually, it won't. It might. Yeah, you know, it won't be Tuesday next week. Thursday next week. I think. Hold on. Thursday next week. I think. We'll see.
How's it going today, ma'am? Hey, how's it going? Um, not good. Uh, so I got kicked out of the LTD because I told them their floors were dirty, and then you guys threatened me, and then somehow I get trespassed. And so I come down here to get my goods, and I walk in, and I get all my goods, and then I go to hand them my 50% off coupons, and he won't accept them. Okay, um, first question, are your coupons for here? Yeah, they're 24 set Here, you can look at them. Oh, okay. Yeah, alrighty, so it's half off. Am I reading this right? Let's see, half off of what? Everything? Yeah, it's two 50% off coupons, and there's no items listed on there. It just says half off of purchase. So I figured I'll use two of them and get 100% off my purchase. Uh, well, I'm not sure it exactly works that way. We can talk to the clerk and see, but uh, normally coupons don't really work that way. You can't stack well, them. 50 plus 50 equals 100. I mean, at most, if you're doing math, you get 50% off, and then you get 50% off of that, so it's more like 75% off. Hold on, I got another one. That's going to be 82.5% um, off then. I think these will work. Oh my God, you are uh, one of those coupon ladies, aren't you? How do you think I afford my large house? I gotta save I money see. somewhere. I mean, come on. I see. Okay, well, let's go talk to the clerk, see what he wants to do about this, okay? Yeah, please. Okay, there's a bunch of cops on now. We're good. Hello, hello. Officer Beard Fasse with the Metro oh, it's Police Beard Fasse. Um, so what is your policy on stacking coupons here? Because uh, these do look like valid coupons. Is he calling you stupid? Uh, I think he is. It's a good point. Um. Okay. So, yeah. All right, ma'am. These what? first of all, these coupons are expired, so they're not even good here anyway. What and then, you, of what? course, no. Uh, if you can see right here on the date, they are actually expired. Uh, and whatever. They're expired by a good amount, ma'am. I mean, these are four years old. Whatever. Okay. Sorry about that. Have a nice day, man. Should I kick his car? Well, I'm gonna give him. I'm gonna give him shit. You LSPD cops are the worst. You don't even help me. You're so. Well, mm. I Ugh. can't help you with expired. Whatever. Hold on. Hold on. Also, when did they let old men join the police force? Like, isn't there some age limit? Oh my God. I'm not even old. Did he call backup? Stab him? No, I'm not gonna stab him. Hey, tell this idiot cop that I need to use my coupons. He's too Man, old to again. comprehend. I think he graduated high school in like okay. 1952. All right, Susan. Hold on for a second. Don't leave. I need to speak with you. Uh, I'm just going to speak Whenever. to the officer real quick, okay? Give him the foo -woo? Yeah. I got to figure out what's the actual... Uh, Understandable. Yeah, it looked like uh, we're a little short staffed today. Yeah, just a little bit. Luckily, it looks like some more people are getting on duty. That's good. That's good. All right, 
Yeah, alrighty. I'll, I'll... Can you write me a ticket for misuse in 911? Very classy, man. Very classy. Who woo to you too, though? I'm sorry, what did you say? Ooh, woo. What's your name and badge number? I am uh, Officer Beard Fassay, and my badge number is 050. Yeah, okay. Can you repeat what you just said again? Because I heard it, and then you said something different. I said, ooh, woo. God, these that's, old people trying to be slick. That's Jin Y for having. I can't with you, guy. Have a nice day, too. You said have a nice day. Can I help you? That siren is very loud. All right, Susan, turn around for me. Face for away. what? Just face away. No. Stop moving. Stop no. moving. <laughs> she he was going to arrest me. That's it. Here we go. <laughs> Game on. Get out of the round! This Escalade is actually pretty slick. Oh my God, I have no traction. I can't turn at all. Tunnel trick where? There's no, I mean, the only tunnel here is a mile and a half long and they can see through it. I'm staying in the city. Oh, we're getting some distance. We're getting some distance. We're getting some distance. Oh! Yeah, that's, that's it. Damn it. Susan, if you don't stop, you're going to get tased. Into the parking garage. Stop, Susan. I'm going to tase him. Stop running. Put your hands up. Stop. Danger, danger. You point that at me again, you're getting shot. Danger, danger. Stop.
They're still shooting me. Oh, what is this? What is this? What is this? Point that shot. Point it and shot, you're gonna die. Should I point it? Should I point it? <laughs> Just put it down, Susan. I'm gonna count to three. Drop the taser. Should I? Should I? One. Two. Go! <laughs> oh! Damn it! Good grief! Jesus! I was just. I was gonna give her a notice to appear. And she had to make it into this whole ordeal. Grab <laughs> <laughs> a med bag. Damn prongs out of me now. <laughs> you hear me, Susan? <laughs> Make some alien noises. I know, that's why I went first person. No, there's more than three cops. There is now one, two, three, right, four, five, six, dogs. seven, eight, nine, ten cops on. Yep. And here you go. Here's the dogs. Right. And still a hell of a amount of civs. So we're not, we're going to stay civ. All over a coupon. Hey, stay with me, Susan, okay? <laughs> Somebody get county medic started. Yeah, I got you over. And then he uh, grabbed me some chest heels out of the bag now. I mean, it is a little overkill, especially if I'm running away. But to be honest, uh, yep, here you go. I mean, it could be seen as deadly force in a way. If it hits someone in the right spot or whatever. Can you still hear me, Susan? Susan, do you have any uh, coupons to pillbox? Yeah, she might need some of those. <laughs> They're probably expired, though. <laughs> probably expired, though. Oh, there it is. It looks like the medics are showing up. I'm trying to coordinate something that you're all going to love. Nope. Oh, yep. There's County. <laughs> hey guys. Susan Live Matters. She's got some bullet holes in her. They've applied some gauze over here, but we'll turn her over to you all. Oh. Um, she might have an expired coupon for an ambulance ride. I'm not sure. All righty. <laughs> Welcome back. <laughs> and a lovely ooh to you, man. And goes back unconscious. Ooh woo. <laughs> oh, so good. Gentlemen, I am sorry. I'm just letting y'all know right now I'm a lousy shot, so. Yeah, put your med back. back in here. And there you go. Now for the lockdown from the car. Trying to hear it. it was Shadow and Jason and all. Okay. Alright, let's go, um. Let's go plan the next thing. Let's just go up here. Screw it. <laughs> oh, boy. I got 
to go. MP saved. Steven Tyler. And then I have to go here. Here. Okay. Beautiful. Um, hold on. Let me... I don't know if he's going to get that, but... I got the Steven Tyler character out. I just got to find his vehicle. I don't know where it is. There it is. Is he streaming? Is Jimmy streaming right now? Stand by. I'm looking. Still looking. I'm trying to get a hold of him. He's not answering. I could call him, but this character doesn't know Jimmy. Um, so I'm trying to avoid that. But I, and plus, people can hear what he's saying in game, like if he talks back to me. So I'm trying to avoid that. Oh, I see. S and S pistol in center console. Lots of coupon books and HOA merch. I sent him a Teamspeak ping. He hasn't gotten back to me. I sent him a Discord thing. He hasn't gotten back to me. I'm just going to call him. Screw it. I'd message him on. Hello. Jimmy, is this you? What? Where are you? Where are you? I'm not interested in whatever you're selling. I'm selling lots of money in a future of promise. Oh, he hung up. No. Good news is Jimmy won't remember. We can call him right back. <laughs> Jimmy, you better not decline my call. Jimmy? Jimmy? Hello? What? You, you want to help me with something? What? A 
I can guarantee you it'll make you a lot of money quick. I'm at Bishop's. Bishop's in, in Mere Park? Uh, no, uh, b b Bishop's on, uh, you, you, 136. One, three, don't move, I'll be right there. <laughs> One, three, six. This car might be the, the key to snow driving, man. Oh my god, this car is the key to snow driving. I mean, besides me drifting horribly, but this car, oh my, it grips. Let's see how well it does, though, on. Uh... Oh, we're going to try to get Jimmy involved in some horribleness but hopefully because Jimmy is super dementiated and doesn't know what's going on that the cops will let him go Of course there's a cop right there. Who is it? 211? It's Kyle. Should probably look to see if this dude's revoked or suspended or actually has a warrant. Oh, Steven Tyler, let's see. Suspended driver's license. Okay, so we can't get pulled over right away. Well, see, people with dementia will remember certain things, especially if they have long-term con connections with it. And if you keep running into the same people over and over, you'll associate things with them. So he probably is, is associating, you know, a police car, or the license plate number with my name or Paul's name, something like that. Also, what's the chances this guy wandered? And he's no longer at 136. Probably a pretty good chance, isn't it? I have run so many stoplights, but it's okay. No one's seen it. Oh. There's a crap ton of cops there. Got it. Okay. I think that's Jimmy standing right there, but there's also a ton of cops, so. What did you do? Oh, it's Brody. I'm just going to wait in the car. What the hell move was that? What are you talking about? You literally just almost hit my vehicle running in here at a high rate of speed. Mm, I think you need glasses. That was just on my end? I think you need glasses. Well, because uh, 
that and you, the little burnout you did over there at the intersection? What was I, that about? Again, I think you need glasses. I, it's I don't slick need out. glasses, sir. Yeah, but this vehicle shouldn't be doing that because look at the tires on it. They look like all season tires. Your point? Just, just don't do it again. Runs him over. You're a Uber driver? Yeah. <laughs> oh, this is going to be too good. This is going to be way too good. Oh boy. That officer needs to mind his business. Agreed. I did I didn't even come close to his car. Not to mention I didn't even do a burnout. No, Jimmy Jimmy knows I'm here, don't you worry. Hello? Hey, Jimmy. Is that you in the truck? Yeah, the camo one that you can barely see. I uh, can't see anything at all. I will be on my way. Uh, give me one moment. I'm handling some business. Okay. <laughs> oh, this is going to be good. This is going to be too good. I'm going to start a whole new recording because this is going to be good. Jimmy. Uh, hello. How are you? Oh, I'm fine. Uh, who the shit are you? I'm a buddy of a buddy that you know. Sure. Uh, I'm a very popular. I heard you want to make some money. And you like money. Sure. I got a proposition to make. Do you know someone by the name of Matt Francis? you know the name of someone called Paul? I've never heard of those people before in my life. How about 311? Sure, yeah, he's a wonderful guy. A, a and, real a real pal. And 901. Sure, yeah, yeah, wonderful. They told me uh, I could trust you. I'm a special little guy. They told me I could trust you. Sure. You want to rob a bank with me? Sure. All right, let's do it. Well, that was easy. Uh, I'm Jimmy Carroll. Uh, I'm 85. Uh, I have dementia. I'm Steven Tyler. Uh, I have a driver's license. Uh, can I drive? Uh, when we get there, you could be the getaway driver. Sure. Uh, that's probably a terrible idea. Well, I don't have a license. I'm suspended. I wouldn't know what that feels like. <laughs> I'm a registered and licensed driver in this state. Good for you, sir. Good for you. We're going to go to the Vinewood Bank. Sure. Specific it standard. Beat the shit out of them. Oh, yeah. You got a, uh, you got the, a gun? No. You want a gun? Sure. Okay, let's get you a gun. Every junior deputy sh should have a firearm. Junior deputy? No, 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 no. Now, right now, you are a cold-hardened criminal. Sure. Uh, a real hot ass. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's the mentality I like. You got your seatbelt on? 
I would put it on. There's a lot of police around harassing people. I know. Tell me about it. A bunch of toids. Yeah. What kind of gun you want? Uh, one that goes skibbity uh, beep beep beep. I think I know the perfect one. Uh, yeah, yeah, that sounds about right. Good thing the ammunition's right here. Alright, let's get you that gun. Well, so am I. That doesn't stop us, though. So. Come on. Sure. I need someone to bust kneecaps. Uh, beat the shit out of them. Yeah, use that cane you got. Uh, hold him a cane point. And your firearm. Come here. Before we beat the shit out of you. Here, Jimmy. Let me get you. Me, you know, I'll just walk back there and grab it. I think this one's about good for you. The Assault Rifle MK2. I think it's perfect. Make all those noises you just made. Yeah, listen to mine. Yeah. All right, let's get these and let's go. Uh, I want a pair of sunglasses. Oh yeah, yeah, take one. Let's go ahead. I'll be in the car. Jimmy! Get in. So what? Where are you going? Uh, I don't know. Put your seatbelt on. You must have forgot where the car was. You see a cop in the intersection? I, I don't. Okay, we're going. Hold on. Get on the road. Hey. Almost had to have you bust his kneecaps. All right, Jimmy, you ready for this? So what? Right, we go in, take that skibbity bop a boom boom thing you got there, and just start threatening people with it. Don't shoot. Just threaten them, okay? So what? And then I'll go get the money. Uh, you know what? You go get the money. I'll threaten the people. You know what? Let's both go get the money and threaten the people. How's that sound? Yeah, I like that better. All right, it's right around the corner, Jimmy. You ready? Hey, we're going to beat the shit out of people. All right, you ready? See these doors right here? We're going to go in these doors. 
Get that gun. Get that skibbity bop bop boop thing you got. No, Jimmy, Jimmy, no, no, no. No, 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 Jimmy, no, no, Jimmy. Go inside the building, damn it. Sure. Inside. In here. God damn it. Whatever you do, Jimmy, do not, do not let them hit any buttons. Sure. Hey, if you push a button, I'm going to beat the shit out of you. Let's get the money. I'm going to go get the money. Sure. Oh, God. Jimmy! 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 Are you good with are you good with computers? No. Well, I need you to break this thing. Beat its kneecaps, then. Uh, I we pushed get all it the open. buttons. I well, pushed all the buttons at, at the same time. <laughs> oh, I got it. There it is. Oh, that it just takes some shots. Okay. I got the money. Look at this. This is all ours. Let's go. We gotta get the the. We gotta go up to the rooms up top, though, and get some stuff from there. Sure. Hey, we're back. If you push the button, I'm gonna know it. I'm gonna beat the shit out of you. Hey, was it you, Linda? Hey, did you... <laughs> was it you, Linda? I could have went up those stairs, but I'm going up these stairs. Jimmy, I see, I see flashing lights. I think the cops are here. Uh, that's not good. Don't stay inside, okay? Don't go outside. Cops are here, Jimmy. Cops are here. Uh, I'm scared. Uh, I'm going upstairs. Uh, are you holding me hostage? Uh, not yet. Uh, should I throw my weapon? No, no. Keep that. We might need it. Who pushed the button? That button got pushed in there, Jimmy. Uh, I'm, I'm gonna go beat the shit out of him. Yeah, you do that. The the button had to have gotten pushed. The alarms are going off. Uh, I'm scared. You you'll be all right. Okay. Is this your first robbery? No, no. I'm going to the side door. They're they're there. They're uh, there. Are we for the car? No, no, they're there. They're Jim they're there, Jimmy. We're I think we're pretty much stuck. Nope. They're shooting at us. Alright, Jimmy. Put that gun down. Uh, I am so scared.
Hold on. I gotta, rem I gotta remember what it is. Hold on. Here, come here. Uh, pull your weapon out. Uh, TH me. There we go. Oh my god. Okay. Okay. No, 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 I'm not gonna hurt you, Jimmy. This is literally. This is. This is. This is how we're gonna get out of here, okay? Uh, you promise? I promise. We got all that money, remember? It's sitting right there on the floor. Sure. Uh, please, uh, everybody. I'm scared. Uh, oh, oh, they shot God. you, Jimmy! Oh, they shot the hostage! That's... Oh, Jimmy, stay with me, buddy! No, stay with me! <laughs> I'm gonna drag you, okay? I'm gonna drag you, buddy. Don't you worry. It's okay, buddy. Oh, I can't undrag you now. I think you have to come alive again. All right, I, you're okay, Jimmy. I didn't want you to die, buddy. It's okay. Hey, you promise. I'm, I'm, you're still alive, buddy. It's okay. We'll get you out. Uh, my face hurts. I, I know. I don't know if I can get you to the car in time, buddy. I don't know. Jimmy. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna call, hold on, let me call 911. Then it is 911, what's the location of emergency? Hey, I'm at the Pacific Standard Bank, 575, I want to talk to the person in charge. Well, we don't really have a person in charge right now. What what can I help you with? You shot the hostage. Okay. You well, shot the hostage. Well, I do apologize about that. No. You apologize. Why, Jimmy, they apologize, by the way. They, they, uh, they're very mean people. Yeah, they are mean people. Uh, a bunch of beeholes. Yeah. Yeah. The hostage isn't very happy that you shot him. I want to way out to my car right there. Well, we can't really do that because, you know, you shot at us. So obviously, you know, what, what, what do you need other than to get a way out? To take, that's to, what everyone wants to take this briefcase of money with me. That's it. I have to poop. Okay. To oh. take the briefcase of money with you. Yeah. This money okay, I got. sorry. I had other people in my ear. I, I didn't understand. I didn't hear you. Okay. Anything else other than a way out with the money? No. That's it. Okay. Do you need any medical attention? No, but the hostage might. Although, I think he just got up and ran. I don't know where Did he was hit. Did you just say hit. he got up and ran? I don't know where he was hit, but yeah, I think he ran out the front door. He said he had to poop. Oh. He, he's back inside. He wants an apology. He's standing at the door. Jimmy, get over here. They're going to shoot you again. Uh, take uh, take that briefcase of money there on the ground. Okay, I will see what I can do about getting Three you away out of here, okay? Let me let me coordinate. Stay in line here. I'm going to talk with my officers here, okay? You better hurry. you got five minutes. Okay. What is, what is your uh, in-brain uh, in phone number so I can give you a call here? 807. 
Okay, I'll give you a call here in a minute, okay? Yep. Jimmy, I'm very sorry. Did you did you take your poop? No. Well, again, they apologized. Very much. Yeah, it was awful. Uh, where'd, they, where'd they shoot you? Uh, they blew my ear off. Uh, oh. Me and my shoulder. Oh, that that's not good. Listen, I told them we need to get out of here, and uh, I think they still think you're a hostage, which is good. Uh, wonderful. So you might not you might not be involved. Uh, round two. Round two of what? Oh, I mean, yeah, we could. Hold on, let me let me put this, let me sling this and get this. Hey, look at all my blood on your shoulder, and on the floor. Yeah, and your ears uh, bleeding a little. I don't feel a thing. It's okay. Let's go this way. Wonder if they're gonna uh, shoot you again if we go outside. I'm scared. Yeah, you promised that it was gonna be okay. I, I do promise, okay? I'll get you yeah, out of here. you already did that, and I got shot in the ear. Hey, hey don't shoot me, please. Hey, please don't shoot me again. Can you hear me? Yeah. Hey, pl hey, please don't shoot me again. What? I'm scared. Hey, hey, hey. Uh, I'm almost more scared of the police than, than I am this man. Uh, he didn't shoot me, you did. Sir! What do you want? If you can hear me, this is the Los Santos Police Department. Oh, uh, we got that. Alright, let's go back inside, Jimmy. I'm done with them. What's the chances we get out of here? Uh, uh, very slim. I'm waiting for a call back, but they haven't called me. Let's go well, this way. We'll call them back. Let's see how many cops are out here. Although these cops shot you, so. Uh, please don't shoot me again. Yeah, we'll, we'll stay in here, Jimmy. Okay. Again, I don't think they know you're involved, so you'll get some good money regardless. If not, you'll just you could just sue the sue the LSPD for shooting you. Sure, I think that's probably gonna be my best bet. Goddamn heathens! Yeah, you might get millions, buddy. Well, I'm gonna give them an ultimatum. Hey! Hey! Apparently they don't want to talk anymore. Go back this way. They were very communicative down here. Hey! 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 Move. You got about three seconds to call me back. I'm gonna call you back. I was just about to call you back. Hey, hey do you want me to try to call them? I think if they don't call me, then we're gonna have issues, Jimmy. Uh, hey, can I shoot you in the foot? No, uh, no, it no. It almost feels even at this point. No, I don't, I don't, I don't, oh, this is them, I think. Uh, please. Hello? 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 Hold on, Jimmy. Yeah, hello? Can you hear me? Yeah. This is the PD? Deputy Cockery from the Los Santos Police Department. Okay. What are you gonna do right, for so we me? So we moved out of the, we moved our we moved our cars, and you have a clear shot to your vehicle, okay? Yeah. Why do I think you're lying? I, I, 
I'm not lying, sir. I was just you out can, there. You, can you were sitting right there. Moved our vehicles. Well, you have a clear shot to your vehicle. Hold on. Let me look. Come on, Jimmy. We got we to gotta go look again. Sure. You do anything stupid, I'm going to kill this guy. Uh, do you mean... Do anything stupid, sir. Well, you shot him first, so I mean... That wasn't me, and uh, the person uh, that shot him said he may give him an apology. You just might want to tell Jim. Uh, uh, tell him I acquire medical attention and God inform him back car. shit off. You do anything uh, with my car? Want, well, we want safe Sir. passage. No, uh, no well, we haven't touched your vehicle. Get in, Jimmy. All right, we're free. And just like that, they're just gonna let us go. I I guess it's that easy, buddy. Sure. You got that briefcase, I, I right? Took a bullet to the ear. Sure. Okay, good. It's under my sweater. Apparently, it's literally that easy. Well, all right, let's, uh, hold on, where do we, where do we gotta go? Uh, I don't know where to go. I didn't plan this far, buddy. Uh, I can't believe it, it was that easy. Uh, you should probably drop me off at the hospital. Hospital? Yeah, oh, that's a good idea. Yeah, let's turn you around, hold on. Just remember, they're gonna they're gonna call you in because you got a GSW, okay? Sure. Just remember hey, that. Hey, 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 you keep the money. No, you take half of it. Here, take a couple bands, at least for your hospital bills. Hey, it was wonderful meeting you. I love. Yep. Nice, nice meeting you too, Jimmy. Love you, buddy. Uh, love you. Well, that was easy. I'm going to try to go to the county, but I'm going to go these back roads here, not like 13 or GOH. Just gonna involve us doing some sketchy stuff past these areas. Oh, they put a radio in.
chat. I'm, I know I'm recording this right now, but there is legit. I saw someone mention there's an officer in the trunk. There is legit an officer in the trunk right now. <laughs> Hand, let me see him. Hands, right now. Zero zero five one zero zero seven in Stab City. What? Where did you come from? Your trunk was unlocked. Hey, stop walking away. Stop. Why? Oh, my God. I think we got away. Oh my god. Oh my god.
Oh, I thought he was coming for me. We're gonna keep going. Uh. Oh boy. If we can make it back to our house, they. I don't think they got an idea. Yet. I don't think they got an idea. Oh. Oh my god. I thought I was dead. I'm making it back to my house. What is this, Jimmy? Hello? Hey, this is Deputy Cox, or Officer Cox, we're at the Los Santos Police Department. Can I help you? So I can have a technical difficulty. Can I help you? Uh, well, so, what, what? I, I just want to talk to you man to man. Um, so, what? Wait, was Jimmy involved though in the whole thing with you? No, no, he was a witness. He was he was in there. It, it wasn't Jimmy. Okay, so what 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 happened? Why why you why did you do this? Do what? I did I needed the money, I man. You robbed the bank. I need the money. I, okay, but like, there's other ways to do this, right? I don't have time to talk. I'm a little busy. Well, what do you, so, no, I, I just want to talk to you man to man. I'm not trying to, to, you know, hook you up or anything. I just want to talk to you, figure out what happened. I'm busy. Gotta go. Bye. Track that shit. Let me call him back. Hold on, I got words for him. Officer Cox here. Hey, I got words for you, actually. What's going on? You shot an old man who was a hostage. Hey. Okay. What about the old man hostage? You shot him. I didn't shoot him. That was another officer. Well, you still shot him, and for that, you go to hell. They're pinging the phone, but... I'm dumb, so I really don't know that. Right, we're gonna ditch let's ditch this phone up here
I'm gonna call it this old lady. My house is right over here. Oh shit, oh shit, oh, oh, I hear the cops. That's not good. Gotta go this way. Giving him breadcrumbs. There's my house. Was a good shot. I just hit him with my truck one zero three five. Really? Put your hands up. Put your fucking hands up now. Where is he at? I don't see him. <laughs> um, to, for me, he's to the left. Um, for me, he's right here in the bush. Okay. I think. Oh, he's not in the bush. I don't see him at all. He's right here. He's right here in front of me. Um, <laughs> um, the, the, the suspect might want to come back to life and fix it. Cause like he's three different places for people. Hey, oh, there. he's right there in front of the vehicle. Okay. Put your hands up. Don't fucking move. Hey, right, let me, let me back the truck up. Yeah, because the radiator isn't face burning him a little. There's somebody who we got to cover. Someone wants to go in. I got a rifle, so if he goes, he right, if I'll, he gets up, he's getting shot. I'll, I'll go. Put my slowly rifle out of your car. I'll... All right, he's secure. Wow, what a dirt bag for taking an old man. Especially Jim. We have medics in route for him. Listen, I understand taking a threat out and all, but really, I mean, running someone over, I was literally, I was going to the 24 seven. I was just going to have a shootout and end up probably dead because I'd already been shot twice. So 
I understand taking someone out and all that fun stuff, but, uh... I mean, he was running in flip-flop. Yeah, what the heck? There's slides, slides, booms. On? There's slides. He has How was he sli running like that I didn't even snow? know that. Yeah, look! Aren't his feet cold from the snow? I, I don't know. I mean, probably, probably not fast anymore, fast. but... Is that a cop on a bicycle? Yeah, that... That ruined the RP for any shootout. Anything like that. It was so good, too. They had someone in my trunk. They were pinging the radio. They were pinging my cell phone. I was giving them breadcrumbs. And just to end it like that, like... Dumb. Who was that in the charger that just rolled up, got out, got back in, and drove away? Like they wanted nothing to do with this situation. No, I think the one pulled up on a bicycle. And then they got yeah, who there. pulled up on a bicycle? I have no idea. I have no idea. Well, they got EMS on, so this will be an easy one for him. I know, I know it's a very legit way. Well, I mean, not very legit. It is used in real life to end threats like this. I get it. I understand that. But to end an RP like that that's been going on for 45 minutes. Really? That was going so well on all aspects. Actually, yeah, I might need to get that to get back to the city, so. Yeah. Is what it is. Have a look. Not breathing. Broken Was it a fucking neck tonight? and spine. From being run over. Literally not much I can do. Damn it. He's cold. Yeah, he was going like Mach 50. <sighs> Time of death, 22 to 37. We'll go and notify corner. <sighs> All right. Sucks. Oh, well, can't say at the mall. Shit. All right. Well, I'm gonna hand you guys over to you till Candy Corner arrives. So. All right. All right. Have a good, have a good one. <laughs> well, what's not chat? What are we doing next? I'm not just gonna go around murdering people because that's not the way I play. So that's kind of off the table. Um, however. What do you want to see next? Alright, well, I'm going to head back to the city for a jurisdiction, so. Already, uh, you got it from here, you want me to yeah, head out? Yeah, corner shouldn't be too far out. Alright. Car is more lethal than the gunshot sometimes? Yeah, why, it's a Tahoe. What's a Tahoe way? Hold on.
Too much of a Tahoe waste. 2020 Chevy Tahoe weight. Uh, about 5,500 pounds. So, not oh, County Corner Rise. Beautiful. Oh. Petty theft? I mean, we kind of did some petty stuff earlier with the whole Susan Whitehead. Could do some disorderly conduct stuff. Salty Man's Customs with the two dollars. Tile is a four K pound bullet. Yeah, you got that right. Yeah, I got destroyed by a three ton missile. Drunk Santa. Your homeless guy? Oh, we could do the homeless guy. I was going to do a follow-up video that he made it to, like, the city line. But, quite frankly, I don't trust any of these officers on right now. I don't I don't think any of them would have a good interaction with him, though, like Jeff did. And I can't, it's hard. It's going to be hard to beat what Jeff did for the guy, but... Um, Um, I kind of want to do a follow-up to that, though. He makes it down there for the holidays or whatever. That's the weight of 335,000 9 millimeter rounds. There it is. Celebrating the World Cup, giving you a reason to burn things. There it is. Let's, uh... Jason would be really good with the homeless man, but he's a sieve now. That's the problem. And I still have to do... Um... Well, let's... Let's go back up. Let's go back up to our staging area, why don't we? Oh, where is it? There it is. Um, I, I want to do unlegit stuff, but be legit, so... I kind of want to... Washington Tow now available. 347, who's towing? Hmm, never seen them towing. Prison Scape, no, I, I did something big there. Give them a break from me. Do, 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 do. Homeless guy hiding in cop's trunks trying to get a ride back to the county. Ooh. Hmm. A conspiracy? Yes. You nailed it right there. Hold on. You nailed it. Now do I have one? Actually, this guy might be good. He might he might not even have a license, which would be even better. He's suspended. Oh yeah. Hold on. <laughs> okay, we got we got two choices. We got two choices, okay? We could do the conspiracy theory. We're going to vote on this, okay? We're going to do a poll. We're going to do alien dude. 
or we're gonna do homeless dude it's probably gonna be like the last character for tonight anyways because the last one we've been going for like an hour with so there you go vote away uh i'm gonna end it at oh god that helicopter's low i'm gonna end it here in just a couple minutes okay at 10 well let's just call it 10 50 i'm gonna end it so six minutes okay and during this time i'm gonna go fill up my drink i'm going to uh go to the bathroom because i really gotta pee oh those are flipping over amazon van ltd 411 oh boy um and then go from there okay so you got like four minutes Good luck. All right. Alien dude with a very strong lead currently. 68% of the votes. You got about... Yeah, two and a half minutes or so left. But I am going to start with an alien dude, okay? It looks like that's going to win, so I'm going to start kind of... This, actually, I might just leave this, but... I think we have to. I think this is still stolen. Hold on. Stolen. Yep, it is. Okay. So I've never been caught in this. So this is going to be like our camper van, dude. That, um... We're going to go around. We got like... Those are like solar panels and satellites hanging off this thing. And we heard about it. And we're just going to go around. And, uh... We're, gonna, we're just going to go around and like ask people what they know. So unless alien dude, or unless uh, 
homeless dude can get like 41% more votes. Uh, it looks like this is what we're going to do. Use the alien body with normal head. No, I'm just going to use this dude because he looks crazy. I think it's safe. Do we think it's safe to call it a minute early? I mean, it does have 69% of the vote currently. All right, we're going to end the... Yep, 70%. It's still going up. We're going to end it. Alien dude for the win. All right. Oh god, that one was skill issue, okay? That was very much skill issue, I promise on that one. What do I got for guns? Okay, yeah, we're, we're good with guns. Yeah, everyone's still hyped up on the aliens. Listen, I'll be completely frank with you all. Because Boat Boy doesn't know what being frank means. Um, but... I don't know if there's going to be a continuation of that. There might be, there might not be. I, I don't know. Um, so just be prepared. We got six hours of it, five hours, something like that of it yesterday. So, e-break test. Not good at all. Also heard the LTD in Mirror Park at 441 was open or something like that, which is also where that bulldozer is, which might be an alien conspiracy theory. So that's where we're heading first. Also, this truck is stolen. I'm suspended. Um, but yeah. Get out of the way. Everyone get out of my way. Screw you. Yeah, just don't get pulled over in this giant, massive lump of camper. This is going to be a horrible pursuit when this happens. Because we have zero traction in this vehicle. Zero traction in this thing. Oh my god. Oh, oh no. Temporary freeze. We're good. We're okay. Three hundred feet to come to a stop. Yeah, it sounds about right. Cops here. Wait. Wonder if there's like, is there like an alien head thing? Like a hat?
There we go. That's, I hadn't seen him before, but now I do. Excuse me, sir. What is with your giant space helmet? Hey, man, you, uh, you hear the news today? I tend to avoid the news because it's often very unbearably sad. Yeah, man, I'm I'm from Liberty City. I heard there's a, the Weasel News is reporting there's a bunch of aliens around. I hope Alien? they blow the world up. Okay, yeah, aliens. Cool hold on, let me hold on. I got a device. That's fake. Yeah, they started selling oh, replicas of this thing. I don't know. What it's the heck well, is this, that thing? this is a toy, but it's the replica, the real thing, I guess. Okay, so the toy does nothing. Not that I'm aware of. It's just it's cool though, you know. Then why why are you showing me it? it doesn't uh, prove anything. Well, I mean, why why else would they be selling these if the FIB and Weasel News is saying that these were the the thing last night? Wait, they're selling them? They're toys. I, I, it's a toy, yeah. For children. No, no, actually it's rated 25 and plus. You know what? Oh. Yeah. And you buy Aliens, it, huh? man. Aliens, they're here. I got my Have whole I got my whole alien? I got my whole van set up. Got the solar panels, got the antennas, got everything. You should be friends with this guy. Um, are you supposed to be in that? Um. Oh, who just? Oh, who just yeah. turned off my car? I got uh, it. One of, yeah, one of the goth guys. Oh. I was too slow. God, he uh, and his friend are ruining my day. Hey, uh, officer. Yeah. Do you have any comment on the aliens that Weasel News is reporting were seen last night? I know what you know. Wh okay, what do you know? Because I know nothing. Well, then I know nothing. Well, then I know everything. Okay, so you, what do you know? Well, I asked you first. I just know my van was destroyed. The aliens didn't destroy your van, though. I mean, they might have. No, it was a bulldozer. No, I, I it definitely might. Was it levitating? It might have been nope. the aliens. Nope, it was just a guy. It was just a guy wearing all black driving the bulldozer. Sounds like an alien. Well, we, got, we finally got him, by the way. Um, I'm going to well, go over you? here. Yeah, we got him. Um, I assume you want to file charges on him, right? Oh my god, absolutely. Do you, have you seen the van? Yeah, I see the van. Yeah, everyone's you seen the van. You you can't I, file charges on an alien. I'd love to have it's you file the paperwork out, but I don't have my car anymore. I think it's an alien. Yeah, I, Have I you know. seen an alien? That, that was his buddy. Yeah. When? Last night. On the news. I guess I'm going to go call on the an news. Uber. Okay, and see if but I can, in uh, person, with cars. your own eyes. Yeah, right, well, should I, uh, yeah, I was watching the, the TV. Later, I guess? Yeah, okay. Yeah, just yeah, go down to the police department and file a report. The Weasel News was reporting it. All right, well, my name's Caden, Caden Chatterton, if you need to get a hold of me. You want my All number? Right. Weird yeah, Caden, what's your number? 75398. 75398, okay. Here is my business card. All right, if you need to get a hold of me, if uh, just let them know down at the station when you file the report that I'm, I'm the one you spoke to, okay? Right, what's your name? Problem is, on the cops. My badge number Besides Jason is on that uh, dealt with it. Helmet? Thank you. No, right. this is real. I made it. What does uh, what's it, what's it do? Hey, if you guys see my protects me from uh, up, being I'll abducted. One, okay. I will do that. All right, I appreciate it. I think it's gonna stop banding if you get abducted. What? Oh yeah. Okay. Um, do you see that guy in a black suit behind you? Is it, is it 
Like this one right here. In that parking lot right behind you? Yeah, I believe it's it's one of these two. One, I think, with the other guy in the bulldozer. I don't know. Looks, yeah, like okay. Looks like what an alien. That car? Looks like an alien. Is that actually wearing like, suits last night too? Is this like a prank thing? Oi! Oi! Oh my god, it's happening! <laughs> is that a prank? No, man, that's him! Those are the same things that were on Weasel! Oh my god, dude. I'm driven out. We gotta go on our roof here. Did you find them? Oh, Melian! Where are you? Do you know his name? I have your souvenir! Are you sure this isn't a prank? No, man, I'm telling you, Weasel News reported it. That wasn't your buddy in the black suit? No, man. I'm telling you, Weasel News. They don't lie. Well, they, they do. No, they don't, man. That was kind of weird. Why did he leave? Early on, where are you? Hear that? Oh, and the da da. Like that could be some weird summoning thing. I don't know if you want to do that. Oh, that the alien. Where are you? I gotta go find a man. <laughs> oh God, round two, here we go. I need a tall point to summon them. Also, I gotta remember this vehicle stolen. Wait, 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 I got an idea. Oh, I got a real good idea. Not quite top of Maze Bank, but we're going to go to the top of this crane that's down one of these streets here. I think it's down a street this way, actually.
I don't know if there is. If there was a tinfoil hat, I would 100% wear it. Well, let's see if there's a better hat. I don't think there is, though. Like, one with an antenna or something would be amazing. <gasps> I mean, that's shiny. Say we took a, a hat and wrapped it in tinfoil. What was that one? Oh, boy, okay. Oh, the traffic cone. Is it just E cone? Hold on. Prop emotes. Oh, I gotta get the scanner. I'm gonna get the toy. Oh, I can't do them both. Oh, that's unfortunate. All right, let's do Conehead. the way he climbs. <laughs> it does make you a little drunk, but I'm kind of weird, so I'm chasing a news story here. That's all I got. Also, I'm not climbing with him. Hello? Hello? Hey, what's going on? Uh, what the shit are you doing? I'm climbing a ladder to chase some aliens. Where are you at? Uh, I don't even know, man. I'm climbing a ladder on a crane. I hate you, and I hope you fall. No. Oh, Jimmy. Uh, higher. Oh, no, why does it take that away? That's unfortunate. Aliens! I know you're out there. I can hear you. Uh. Oh, aliens! I am win with you. Jimmy's probably going to think I'm tripping on Boat Boy's LSD lollipop again. And baby laxatives. I don't know. Can I spin? Oh, nope, I can't. Nope, not at all. But see, the thing is, the device is a replica, right? It's like one of those where on big news story hits, they're trying to make money off of it, and they just sell a bunch of those, and you get a bunch of conspiracy theorists like me to come out there and, like, try to track them down. We need to go to the county, I think. I think we need to go to the county, to the Humane Labs, and investigate. What does everyone think? I think that's where we need to go. I can get down from here without falling. A replica device that attracted it. Hey, listen, man. Anything can attract an agent. too good here we go you main labs here I come I'm coming for you I will find your secrets 
and I will share them on the edit. I was gonna say Reddit, but I don't know if you know. Climb down is more unsettling. That's very true. Now, we have to go to the scene of the crime. Not even a crime. We just have to go to the scene. And try to get some intel. Veto twist last night. I'm still mind blown about the veto twist. Although, thinking about it, we were talking about this after in Jason's Discord. Um, <clears throat> me, Jason, and Diaz, and a couple other people. Like, if you look at the um, if you look at the um, like timeline of things and how things line up, then. It kind of puts itself together, and you're like, all of that makes sense. Oh, God. Like, the going dark on the radio, the... Creepy dude across from Polito Station. Like, all of that stuff lines up. You just don't realize it when it's spread out that far, and you're like, oh, crap. Hope there's not a cop up here, because this is stolen. Listen, I think Diaz purposely pushed me down the mountain last night. Just saying. And it, it does, again, kind of adds up, you know? <laughs> Coyote just stayed right in the middle of the road. Conspiracy theory finally understood, right? This thing has no brakes. Oh boy. I think when we get there, we're just gonna we're gonna have to park out front because they're obviously not gonna let us in. We're a tourist. We're gonna have to park out front and just start summoning them, Sum summoning them, summon them, mama, summoning them. I got my cone head. Oh, I do. Hold on. Got to get the scanner.
Oh man, this is the place. Oh yeah. Oh aliens, I know you're in there. What is? It? I don't even know how. To... Man, this replica looks lifelike. Man. I should go inside. Hey, security guard, you know anything about these? Oh, get off your prop. Oh, okay. I want to go across. This gate didn't open for a reason. goes on here we need the truck satellites to go steal a weasel news van for the satellites No, let's let's not go in there. Let's go up on the hill. our alien helmet back on too and uh, what number was that there it is oh um, um, oh alien gods I know you're up there Hello? Hello? David Hisman. How, how do you know my name? Reading is lies. You're alone. Aliens are not real. Leave the humane labs immediately. Well, well how do you know? Oh my god. Oh, I gotta go. Oh god. Oh god. They're real. Oh, I'm gonna die though. Okay, we gotta... We gotta regroup here. Because, uh... My alien sense is tingling. Um. What 
Let's just wait here for a second. I need a I need like a camcorder. Uh is there like a um I don't think there is. Oh, we can just do this like we're 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 selfie in it. <laughs> this is David trucking in. I've confirmed the weasel story is true. I saw a truck or a car that looked just like it. I got a creepy phone call. Said I'm alone. They're not real. I'll keep you updated. All right. Let's post this. Let's post this thread. Post. Yo. Confirming. Alien distance at Humane Labs. <sighs> we gotta, we gotta get our hands on one of those devices. I think. Um, I just don't know how. How do we get one of those devices? We have to track one of those agents down. I'm guessing. Um, I think we need to go to Polito, though. I got an idea. We have to go... We have to go find the device that's on the mountain. The weasel story said that the it was lost on the mountain. But I don't think they found the mountain, did they? I don't know where I'm, they just said it was up here. Man. But yeah, the gate didn't open. I s I'm seeing things. No, no, no. I'm just seeing things. No, no, no. The mountain. It's the mountain. Okay. We gotta go up this mountain. It's the only way. We gotta find the device on the mountain.
Yeah, I did see the bug stars ad about keeping the pests away and all that. Where were they? So that's a long way down. Oh my god. Oh no! 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 Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Oh, keep rolling. You're okay, buddy. Tree, save me. <laughs> oh. Oh. Maybe the mountain isn't the place. Maybe that gate opened for a reason. We need to go to Humane Labs. He said not to go there. We need to go to Humane Labs. The mountain's not the place. It's too big of an area. We got no, we have to go take one. We gotta go to Humane Labs. It's the gate. It's the phone call. It's the perfect combination. It's the spot. We have to go to the Humane Labs. And this time we have to go in. I saw it. I saw it. It was right there. It was right there. Where'd it go? <sighs> keep going. Just keep going, David. Just keep going. You gotta get to this story. Finally, people will believe you. Aliens. This truck has no brakes whatsoever.
This is it. This is the place. We have to go inside. But where? I don't think I should be in here. Especially not after that phone call. Oh, look at this place. Hello? Aliens? What is this place? There. I said by the tree. Hello? Aliens? Dude in a suit? What is this place? And where do I get in? Hello?
This place is huge. Cairo Jacks. Uh huh. Hello? 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 Alien dudes? Oh, are these the cages for him? What is going on here? They must be all out. Hello? Hello? Aliens? Where are you? Which way? <gasps> Hello? What? Hello? Dude, stop! What is going on? Hello? Hello? Oh, what's going on? Locked. Huh? What is going on? Hello? What are you doing here? 
I'm uh, uh, I'm looking for aliens. Why do you want to see aliens so bad? Well, there was an article on it last night. Weasel News. Uh, I, I've been chasing them for years. I didn't think they were real. Follow me. Go ahead and stand over here. all this stuff That was a. That was a. Satisfied? That was an alien. Happy you answered your question? Yeah. Yeah. I, I, I can't get a picture with it, can I? I saw that coming. There was no way I was getting out of that. You're lucky I decided to load the tranquilizing guards <laughs> today. Those could have been bullets. You'll wake up in a couple hours. You won't remember a thing. <sighs> and you'll be somewhere that isn't here. Also, I'm taking your phone and all the information you have about anything that you've learned so far. This is some men in, men in black stuff right here. Oh my god. did post already which is a plus that that did happen takes phone removes alien information moves unconscious man to top of Chiliad you don't remember a thing from this event you got you got the humane labs and decided to go for a hike instead then fell asleep Top of Chiliad, here we come. We're just gonna drop ourselves right there. Don't know where this is. Not in a good spot whatsoever. Oh, this looks like a great spot. There we go. <clears throat> wow.
It's going to give it a few, and we're going to wake up and uh, not know a thing. They got lost hiking. Where? Oh. Well, we gotta find our way down. Uh, how do I get out of here? Easy, David. Save yourself. No, we're not gonna play that game. I don't wanna. I wanna actually record some footage here. There we go. Oh. Oh God. That's a. That's not happening. I wanna actually record some footage here of like getting down. Try this way. to go up. Oh, this is a trail. Well, let's get out of here before it's cold. So what's up? What am I doing with this hat? Where's my truck? I 
must have left it at the base of the trail. I don't have a phone or I would call 911. He took my phone. <laughs> so I literally have to run this entire thing. He uh takes phone. He took he took the entire phone. Don't worry, I, I don't mind the run, it's okay. It's gonna be a little while, but. He probably deleted the video that I posted on. On blew it, not read it, blew it. Whatever, green it, yellow it, turquoise it, some, some color, whatever. He probably deleted it. So there's probably certain few people that saw it, but David needs the exercise. Hey, hey now. I ain't even going the right way. Oh, we're going to end up at the weed farm. Okay. Oh, when we get there, we'll use a, a phone at the house and call because we're cold or something. I don't know. Oh yeah, there was for sure people that probably downloaded it and reposted it and all that fun stuff. But um it wasn't many. Probably wasn't many. Especially because like this person, he's been you know, kind of the story that I told the other guys at LTD is he's been gone for years. You can tell none of them believed him. Right? It's aliens. Who's going to believe that, really? Um, so it's kind of one of those, like, conspiracy theory type people that not a lot of people believe. But he still kind of does it because he knows it's true. And obviously, him knowing it's true got him where he was and now where he is now. But he doesn't know that anymore because it got r erased, right? So last time, last thing he knew is... He was at the Humane Labs. And... He went on a hike instead. The only thing David knows now is a bunch of people at um, the LTD in Mirror Park didn't believe him. He went to the Humane Labs because that's, you know, like the, the first time he went to the Humane Labs, that's where he was just going to go. Never got the phone call. Never went to the mountain. Never went back to the Humane Labs. He was just at the Humane Labs. Decided to take a hike instead. And, um... That was it. Oh, there's a house. We gotta go that way. He just remembers taking a hike and he must have fell asleep. That's that's the way he thinks right now. Because he got wiped.
Try not to face plant down this. Also trying to get over somewhere where this trail is, I think. <laughs> there it is. See if we can't borrow a phone here. I'm cold. <sighs> hey, can I borrow a phone, man? I've been on the uh, mountain during this snowstorm, man. Oh, my mom, what's the emergency? I mean, I'm at uh, 1031. I don't even know what road this is on. It's at like some house back here. I was just on Chiliad for like, I don't know, three, four hours, maybe more. I don't know. I'm freezing. I don't know where my car is. I need some help. Okay, so sorry. So you said it was at 1031? Yeah, that's... I. This isn't even my phone. I had to borrow one from... I don't know where my phone went. I had to borrow one from the resident here. He said his address is 1031, but he says it's on like a dirt road. I, I really don't know, man. I'm just... I'm cold. I'm hungry. I'm wet. I'm tired. I don't know where my car is. I don't know where my keys, my phone... And sorry, what, sir, what was your name? It's uh, David Hisman, H I S M A N. And um, I know you're borrowing this phone, but can, do you know um, what the number is for it? Uh, oh, he's saying, I don't know what the number is, but he's saying that it's it's thirty thirty one, not ten thirty one. So I I heard my ears. I'm, I'm sorry, it's thirty thirty one. Okay, no problems. And you don't have a street name? Does the, the caller know by any chance? What the, I mean, by the if, if the owner of the phone know what street name it is by any chance? Uh, he uh, he says it's a dirt road, like off a what road? Off a U Union? And he says like Union Road. No worries. Um, okay, so so we'll um, so you're at 10, 30, uh, 30, 31 on a dirt road off Union Road. You've been uh, exposed. Uh, you're under exposure, like to cold. Lost your vehicle and keys, and you've just basically been hungry and everything. So we'll send an officer out. Is there anything else that you? Um, any other things that? Anything else you wanted us to know? No, no, no. I think that's. I just. I just need some help. Yep, no worries. Well, we'll have an officer out on on um, on the way right now. So um, hold tight, mate. Try and keep try and keep warm as much as you can, and we'll have an officer out to you as soon as possible. I, I appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. <laughs> Beautiful.
Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Yeah, 1031, 3031. It's all the same, man. Where is 1031's like. 1031, oh. Okay. Well, a little bit of a different area. Well, now we, uh, now we wait, because <laughs> they're all in the city, at least as far as I'm aware. Well, round two, day two was good. That, uh, literally, that just shows you right there that, uh, I didn't left that completely up to you guys on whether we went homeless or alien. Like, chaser. Left it completely up to you. So you all decided that. And now look where we are. Just spent three hours on top of Chiliad. Cold, freezing, hungry. No clue where our stuff is. Literally, yeah. Literally, like, easy said. Literally because Jason said we were at the Yellow Jack and not somewhere else. You know, sometimes pranks do go right. <laughs> Braden Biggs is a good dude. Agreed. Very much agreed. What's the? I wonder what the ETA on this cop is. I mean, he is coming from the city, so. But yeah, literally because. Uh. Jason said, eh, let's, uh, let's, you know, tell him he's, we're somewhere else and make him go on a wild goose chase for a little while. I think we're chasing a face car that's actually a real car, but we have no charges on. Sometimes stuff like that goes right. I gotta call 911 back. 911? Uh, yeah, I, I think I missed a call from you guys. Yeah, thank you. Um, so, um, I just wanted to double check some details quickly. I just forgot, I forgot to grab a description of of yourself. Um, what, what, kind of, what clothes are you wearing so the officer will know when you arrive? Uh, I'm wearing like a... That's gonna sound weird, but it's like a Hawaiian shirt. Uh, there's like a... Pink shorts, I'm wearing some Santa, like flip flops and a green helmet. No worries, and sorry, sir, are you, uh, are you Caucasian, black, uh, I'm, what, what I'm, ethnicity? I'm, uh, I'm Caucasian, I'm sitting right by the house Caucasian. Here. Right by the house? Okay, yeah. no worries. The officer is on route, a couple of officers are on route, but I'll just give them a heads up of what to look for. Um, Thank you, sir. Uh, and what was your name again? Sorry, sir, I just realized I wanted to double check. No, it's, it's David. David, that's right. Uh, Hawaiian shirt. Hawaiian shirt, um, sh shorts, p uh, pink shorts, and uh, flip flops. Is that correct, sir? Yeah, with a, a green helmet. With a green helmet. No worries. Thank you, sir. Yeah, no, thank you.
Oh boy. Hi man, how's it going? Welcome in. Back in, I should say. Here we go. Hello. Uh, hey. How's uh, it going? I'm cold. Okay, come over here. Come sit in the vehicle. Uh, if I can walk. Okay, there we go. Oh, uh, what? What? Tell me what happened. I don't know, man. I was, I was, I was driving around, and uh, I don't know. I must uh, must have taken a hike. I was kind of feeling hikey, and I don't know. I, I just, I must have fallen asleep or something like that. Uh, okay, where's your vehicle at? If I don't know. Driving? I don't know. Okay, have you have you taken any drugs today or drink any alcohol? No, man. No, no, no. I was just hiking. You remember what happened? And no, uh, like I said, I was just, I think I was hiking and I woke up and it was cold. What, uh, what kind of vehicle do you drive? Uh, you know? My question is, do you know what day it is? Today? Yeah, it's Sunday. Okay, you know who the president is? Yeah. Who is it? It's Joe Biden. You know what year it is? It's 2022. Okay. What's the last thing you remember? Uh, driving, parking my car. Okay, where'd you turn? Where'd you uh turn it? Where'd you park at? I think uh, humane lambs, maybe. Okay, what, what's with the helmet? Oh man, I'm a online conspiracy theorist. You believe in like aliens and stuff, or? Uh, I mean, kinda, yeah. But other things too, you know. So were you possibly? Right? Yeah, I, th I think maybe. So were you possibly abducted by aliens? I don't know, man. Like I said, I just woke up on the mountain and I was freezing. Okay. I wonder if he got rid of that. Well, we're going to go by Humane Labs and look at your, look for your vehicle. Okay. What kind of vehicle was it? Uh, it was a, I was borrowing a buddy's red camper. I oh, so okay. hope to God he deleted that. Please have deleted that. Please, please. Are I beg you. Do you feel hurt? Do you feel okay? No, I just, it's my fingers and toes. Oh God. We have the heat turned on, so you should be getting heat back there. We have an unflow bat, full blast for you. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Please have deleted that because they're going to see it's stolen. Oh, God, they're going to see it's stolen. No, please don't. Please don't. Please don't. Please don't. <laughs> If they're it's there, I'm gonna tell them it was my buddy was there too. Be like, oh wait, where's my buddy? Oh no, nope, it's there. Yeah, it looks like a red RV, all right. Yeah. Do you remember just leaving it in the road like that? Uh, no. I think it was parked on the sign. I, I really don't know. Alright, well, uh, is there anything in there that's illegal? Anything you need to be worried about? Anything like that? No, oh, no, not at all. No, 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 no. Well, uh, do you want medics to come check you out? You know, I'm, I'll just... I'll drive to the hospital. Are you sure? Do you feel okay what's, to drive? Well, first, what's your name, buddy? Mine? It's David. David what? Uh, Hisman. The Johnny Shapiro. Yep, they're running that tag. They're going to see it's stolen. They're going to see that I'm suspended. Yeah, and this RV's marked stolen. What? No, it's Johnny's. Oh, boy. You know you have a warrant out for your arrest? What? No, man. Do I really? For what? For indictment. Uh, for what? You want to pull him out and pat him down? I don't have a warrant, man. I promise. I don't. I. What? Oh, I do have a warrant. I'm gonna. Why don't you go ahead and step out for me, man? Okay. Uh, I don't have a warrant, man. Oh god. Okay, well, we'll figure that out in a second. I just want to make sure you don't have anything on you, okay? No, I, d I don't. Hey, let me, let me just, let me just patch no, you down man. real quick. No. I, hey man, you I don't have to make it hard. I don't. I'm cold. I'm hungry. I just want to okay, go well, home. We'll, we'll get you some food and stuff here in a minute. We just need to make sure we're all good to go, okay? So. Just, oh, or at the jail. Just, just let me pat you down really quick, okay? It'll be. Let's not make it harder than it needs to be. I don't have anything on me. Okay, I I believe you. I just want to double check. Okay. Look, I got nothing. Okay. Look, well, nothing. Oh. Hey, put your clothes back on. Nothing. You're gonna get freezing, man. I'm already cold. You're gonna get frostbite. You, you have anything in your helmet there? No. Okay. All right, well, go ahead and have a seat in the car then for me, okay? You gonna take me to jail? Well, we're gonna figure that out, okay? I don't have a warrant, man, I promise. Okay, well, we can work with you. Just, we're we're uh, gonna get our dispatch to verify that, okay? So just hop in and hop in in the heat. Yeah, we don't want you uh, getting hypothermia or anything, okay? Come on, man. Let's just get in the car, okay? Oh, fine. All right. Where Come on. All 
Ah! There you go. Alright. I'm gonna look through the truck real quick. <laughs> Whoops! Didn't realize I had a warrant. <laughs> I knew the truck was stolen. I knew I was suspended. I didn't think I had a warrant. Nothing but science, fiction books, books slash articles, weird, uh, TV slash monitors, um, Antennas and what was that? devices. No, I, I mean, I could see it. It's an indictment. You know, I can look at, I can look and see what it is over here. Hold on. is from 818 is suspected in numerous stolen vehicle cases including multiple boats other oh this was it's city extradition only we're in the county it's city extradition only and it should have been cleared uh Sure. What city? August right, 18th. So with uh, city extradition only, as we do work for LSPD, we are going to expedite on that. No, you can't do it. We're in the county though, man. Yeah, but we also are LSPD because we don't have any sheriff on. Screw so. that. Nope. Not how that works, buddy. I need help. Hey, stop. There's the boy. Miss. Help me, stop them. Miss. Miss. I'm out of tasers. Watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out. Uh, Don't uh, fuck him. Uh, uh, no, no. No. I don't have any more cases. All I have is my gun left. I'm trying to get back to there. I'm gonna attack. No. No. Don't fucking move or you're a good shot. No. Don't fucking move. No. 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 You're gonna get shot now. No. No. Bro, why are you shooting me? If you move, you're gonna get shot. I already shot a tire of your vehicle. Oh, you're grabbing me. Stop you can't shoot me for no reason. No, but I can shoot the tire of the RV so you can't drive it. 
which is what I did. Why? Why? Why'd you have to make it hard on yourself, man? Man, it's the city only. I'm in the county. But we work for LSPD. So. Let's walk, let's walk back to the, the truck here. Got a news crew over here. Liam, welcome to the senior officers, buddy. Hey Thank guys, you very leave much. Leave the area for me, please. What are you doing with that man? Leave the let's area for me, please. Labs. Don't worry about it. Leave the area. I'm <laughs> not going to tell you again. Ugh, this is a long walk, man. <laughs> it's cold out here. Did they just steal my van? Uh, I think they just took my my van. They did. We were yeah, that, uh, we know. I just went it over the radio. <laughs> well, now that camper is stolen, stolen. It's Mark stolen and it's stolen. <laughs> oh. oh, that's amazing. That is amazing. Bite on fake tooth and that person dies now. I thought you said that uh, that was your buddy's RV, man. It is. And why is it marked stolen? I don't know. He let me borrow it. Okay. What? What's your buddy's name? It's Jimmy. Oh no, sorry, Johnny. Johnny Shapiro. I don't know why I said Jimmy. The old man's been following me around today. It's Johnny Shapiro. Okay. Yeah, that, that's who's listed as the owner here. Yeah, um, it's his. So if I if I give him a call, is he gonna say that that he let you borrow it or? I mean he should, yeah. I picked it up from his house the other day. I'm I'm from he's an old friend of mine from college. I uh, I live in Liberty City. He lets me borrow it every now and then. Okay. Do you have his phone number by chance? I don't have my phone. It's somewhere on a mountain, or I would tell you. Okay. I I literally have nothing. I woke up with nothing. Alright, I might be able to uh, look it up here on my, my computer. Give me a second. No phone number on record. Gotta steal it back now. No, I think they're trying to help me because that's Jason and the crew. And I kind of know what they're doing. I've been in communication with them a little. So I kind of know what they're doing. Um...
All right, Connie's coming to pick you up. He's there here taking you away. <sighs> well, I can't get out until they get me out, so. The conspiracy theory crew? Yeah, they're kind of doing like a UFO type thing is from what I've heard. Right, man, step out for me here. Alright man, just let me uh, take those cuffs off of you and we'll get you into the county transport cuffs, okay? <laughs> uh... Alrighty, sir, there you go. They should, they're pulling up right here, okay? Alright. Beautiful. Yeah, we've been uh, kind of communicating back and forth. Like, I knew he was on Chilean when I got put on Chilean. He's like, oh crap. And I'm like, nope, you're good. I'm going the other way. That's how it works. Oh, uh, anyways, uh, I think this is where I'm going to call it a night. Uh, let's go... Just go up here. Isn't there, like, a wooden cross up here somewhere? I'll just go chill up here. Oh, boy. Anyways. I'll hold off that for a second. Another lovely, lovely night. This time with a bunch of Civ stuff. Amazing RP to everyone uh, on the Civ side of things. LEO and whatever. Um, anyways, thank you again to Bugs for another lovely night of this Men in Black alien stuff. I still don't know exactly what to call it. It's like Men in Black meets... Men, it's, I guess it's legit Men in Black meets stalking. <laughs> So th thank you very much to Bugs for that. Um, super fun time. And we actually got to see an alien. Which is... Uh, amazing. I wasn't expecting... I honestly wasn't expecting any of that. Like I said, you guys voted on what we were doing. We could be down in the city right now being homeless. I mean, that's a possibility. So. Anywho, let's switch on over. Let's get out of here for tonight. Uh, and go enjoy everything tomorrow you know all the, the lovely days everything like that listen all thank you all for a great weekend i'm glad i am back uh streaming tomorrow i'm not sure if there will be a stream but uh i'll be around so we'll see if we can get a stream going or not and uh and have some fun uh yeah Anyways, tomorrow there will be a new video out for you all. It's the Humane Labs, uh, ironically, it's the Humane Labs standoff we had with Boat Boy, where uh, the one and only Diaz, who just popped in chat, Diaz, you have a good night too, buddy. Uh, Diaz and, uh, well, the other grapes, he got murdered. One by Chuck, one by Friendly Fire, that wasn't me. Um, but that will be out tomorrow. It's out now for all you senior officers and above. Um, so, you know, make sure to check that out and watch it now. I mean, if you're uh, if you're a senior officer, go check it out now. It's not tomorrow, noon Eastern. It will be out live for everyone. Make sure to check out the merch. Make sure to hit the Discord join in there. And uh, yeah, with that being said, we will see you all soon in a very near, a very, the next, whatever, the next stream near to you, whenever that is. Have a good night, everyone. Have a good Monday. Enjoy the week, and uh, we'll see you soon. Later.